Hey, what's up guys? It's Chels. Welcome to my first official video of summer. Today I wanted to do a video that I haven't really done in the past before. I've done a what's on, a, on my iPhone video, but I've never really showed you guys like what my favorite songs are and my type of music that I listen to. Since this is the first video of summer for my channel, I wanted to make it a collaboration and every single person is doing a different type of video and you can check them out in the description. with any of these people except for one so I hope you guys just check out all of them and subscribe to them because I really like all their videos don't forget to subscribe as well I'm trying to reach 1.5 million subscribers and we are very very close <sighs> well without further ado let's go ahead and get into my favorite music all right so as you get into my phone, I'm going to click on my Spotify app and I have quite a lot of playlists. If you have Spotify, pay for Spotify Premium because you can save songs and you can save as many as you want. So here is all of my saved music, which I have quite a lot because anytime you want to like listen to music like on airplane mode, you have to save it and have it downloaded to your phone. So I do that because I'm flying quite a lot, but I wanted to start, let's just start at the bottom of the list right here. All this music is from North Point Inside Out. It's all from like an album that I found through some of my friends who went to this thing called Big Stuff, which is a summer camp that happens in Panama City Beach, Florida. And I've never gone, but I've always wanted to. My friend Lexi goes every single year. I heard this album was on you know, the playlist of like their worship music and it's just so good. Like I really recommend that you guys download that. Here if I get off of my save music because I wanted to show you guys more of like what I've listened to recently. Uh, I had a graduation playlist. This is a really good playlist to uh, follow. There's only about 518 followers but they're all graduation songs so if you're like a junior or a sophomore you can start doing this, especially if you're in like a video production class and you have to make the senior video like I did. This helps a lot because I got some inspiration from this playlist. I'm also following a One Tree Hill playlist because One Tree Hill, if I had a show to describe just love in general, I would just tell someone to watch the show One Tree Hill because if you want to know what love is, then you just watch that show and you're like, wow. This, it's just like, ah, uh, the people who wrote that show, I just really need to meet because they're just probably the best people ever. I know The Funeral by Band of Horses is such a good song. It's in multiple movies. It's so good. So you guys get the idea. That's a really good song. So I just recommend following the One Tree Hill playlist. It's so good. So good. An artist that I recently found, they're called Social Club Misfits. I'm going to search them because I don't have them saved. They have some of the coolest, like, rap, but, like, spoken word songs ever. And I have been in love with Courage and also Coogee Sweater. It's a real good song. And they have multiple albums and they're just such a good group like I would recommend them to just anyone who's looking for Christian rappers and I just yeah someone who I recently found who I am absolutely in love with if you have never ever heard of NF like I had like two days ago then what are you doing with your life because you really need to search him up he has had a lot of hardship in his life and I would say he is a Christian version of Eminem. And he has so much emotion in every single song and his lyrics are just so powerful and my favorite songs by him are Oh Lord, Mansion, and Real. I'd say my favorite one by far though is Oh Lord. Such a good song! I'm 
times I look up to the sky and wonder, do you see us down here? Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Do you see us down here? I've showed you guys a lot of like Christian music and then One Tree Hill and stuff, but I have been loving the song Humble and Kind lately. Such a good country song. If you're in love with country, I'm sure you're in love with this song too. It just has such good lyrics and it sounds really good. I love it. In like less than a month, I'm going to see 21 Pilots with my boyfriend. I got us tickets and we're really excited because I I just love uh, their music. Mm. I feel like if you were to ask someone how to describe 21 Pilots music, they would give you all each unique different answers because I feel like people relate to each and every individual song in a different way. Just like with any artist pretty much. but. They're just, they're so unique, it's hard to describe them. And I'm sure you guys have heard of Stressed Out. That's like one of their popular songs. Maybe Ride or like Tear In My Heart. But Heavy Dirty Soul is so good. And so is Trees. I love Trees. And like their older albums, Vessel is a really good album. I would really recommend Car Radio, Semi-Automatic, Fake You Out, uh, Guns for Hands and Trees. I love all those songs. And Blurry Face is, of course, I think some of their best work as well. I love The Judge, Doubt, Polaroid, Polaroids, Polarize. So good. So, those are some of my favorite songs. Uh, Spotify, I have it connected through like my personal Facebook, but somehow I feel like if you looked up my name, you could follow it because some random people follow it. So if you were to like want to know more of like what I like to listen to, I'm always downloading more music, always creating more playlists, you can go ahead and do that. But yeah, I hope you guys got to get to know me a little bit more in that realm. It's really fun to just find different artists and bands and everything. So if you guys have any people that I need to definitely listen to, comment them down below because I am a fan of pretty much every genre of music except for Screamo. I can't relate to Screamo. <laughs> I love you guys. Thank you guys so much for just continuing to support me and watch my videos. It just means a lot because I know social media is going different directions nowadays and not as many people are on YouTube. So it's really cool that you're still here and it means a lot. So yeah, I love you guys and I'll see you on my social media and in my next video.